Roses are red, violets are blue, sugar is sweet, and then look how full. Hello! Um, I'm pretty sure that's not how that goes. Oops, sorry, can I try again? I guess after all, we're all about giving other second chances. Let's begin again. Roses are red, violets are blue, sugar is sweet, and my dog has the flu. No, no, no! no! It just so are you! Oh, thank you for the compliment. I think I'm pretty sure too, but that's at least what my mom tells me. When we think of Valentine's Day, we all think of love. Yeah! It doesn't have to be much or love. It's like the love we have for our friends and family. On Valentine's Day, we also write and receive Valentine's Day cards. You might decorate a box or bag at school to hold all your cards your friends gave you. Maybe your teacher even gave you a special sweet treat. You may even eat chocolates or candy hearts. All of that is cool, but do you actually know why we celebrate Valentine's Day? A lot of people think that it is a store, that it is a holiday made up by stores so they can make lots of money. <laughs> but that is not the case at all. People had celebrated, had celebrated this special day for centuries. Awesome, dude. Such as like a hundred years. So that's like for a very long time. Hey, that's older than our teacher. Hey, I'm not that old. Just because I was personal friends with George Washington does not mean I'm old. Yes, for centuries, people have celebrated the holiday. Ancient people set February 14th as the day to celebrate love. So this is the story of how Valentine's Day really began. A long time ago, and the Roman people were having a festival on February 15th. Wait, do you say the 15th? Isn't Valentine's Day on the 14th? He did at the time. The calendar they used was different from the one we use today. Weird. Over the years, and the Roman people changed They tweet the holiday a little bit, a little bit. They decided to name the festival Valentine's Day to honor St. Valentine. St. Valentine believed in love. He really liked flowers and gardens too. People loved him so much they would give him flowers and notes telling him how loved he was. Valentine would write notes back and sign them from your Valentine. See where we're going with all this? I get it, I totally get it. The kids brought flowers to Valentine and that's why we give flowers. Valentine wrote letters and signed them from your Valentine. That's why we give Valentines. Over time, the tradition of Valentine's Day spread to many countries around the world. Each country added their own traditions to Valentine's Day. Some traditions were fun, some traditions were cool, and some were just downright weird. Valentine's Day letters were sent all around the world. The oldest one is sitting in the museum in London, England. It was written back in 1415s by a duke. Miss Klein, did you know him too? Very funny. Well, now you know how Valentine's Day really got started. On February 14th, remember to show your friends and family just how much you care. Happy Valentine's!